All right, you've got those crazy work days, you've got school functions and parties. Sometimes you just do not have time to eat properly. You've got to eat on the run, but you can do it healthy too, right? Well, you can try to at least. Lisa Grezelanik <laughs> is here from uh, Lisa G, your tasty life .com. Your tasty life .com is her website. Because it's true, I mean, we talk about preparing and thinking through, but the reality is some of us have to eat on the yeah. go. Yeah, the reality is about 50% of meals are eaten outside the home now. Really? I'm reading some research, and that's 50%. What, up to 50%. Wow. Wow. And the reality also is many of us are spending more time watching cooking shows than cooking. <laughs> yeah, it's almost so, like we call it food porn. Yeah. Excuse the expression, but we true. love watching it, but we don't actually do it. Yeah, we don't, so yeah. of course what you make at home with healthy ingredients made with love is the best thing to do. But if you were out, what would you do? My first stop, if I'm near this uh, location, is in Brookfield. It's called Grassroots Salad Company. Mm. It's a company that's been around for about a year, and they are doing it right. They have figured out how to make tasty, easy meals on the go. Okay. So it's a kiosk inside the food court at Brookfield it's a Square. Mall. Chip was there a long time ago. Mm -hmm. I remember. Okay. It's inside Brookfield Square, they have one location currently, but I really love supporting this company because I want to see more locations. Cool. If, if, if healthy eating was this easy, we would all be doing it. Yeah. But what they have is a whole host of different salads you can see here. So they have a Santa Fe salad, they have something called a Christie salad, an Asian salad, a Cobb salad, a Caesar salad, they have wraps, they also have a bunch of different powerful juices you can use. So they have green juices, is they have a strong. There's no kale. And contrary to what Rob said before the segment, <laughs> there's no kale on anything. In oh, okay, oh, no okay. kale at all. Yeah, but Although they you have, probably could have kale if you yeah, wanted to. Yeah, what do you guys want to try? This one's a, um, a strawberry bliss. What's in the green one? This What's one is it? got apples, greens, and pineapple. It's so good. Um, then they also have a Dr. Roots and oh, Life Clothes. Really so you can see there's different. Um, What's the Dr. Roots? Dr. Roots right here. I can't do banana. I'm okay. Like it. Um, but fresh ingredients, you know, no preservatives, no sugar in those. It's just the fruit and vegetable going oh, in there. Really? There's no sweetener in here at all? No sweetener. No agave or anything None, like no that? No sweetener. Yeah. Just fresh pressed juices. So that's huh. rich with the vitamins, minerals, and a lot of enzymes. Really so we're talking good. for natural energy boost. There you go. So what better way to do your salad than, you know, a nice little green juice with it. So really great company. If you're out in the Brookfield Square area, check them out. It's a no-brainer. I it's love kind getting... Of a build your own salad? Yeah, build too? your own. So, okay. for example, they have a salad called a Cobb salad. And what I like to do on my Cobb salad is I will take off the blue cheese and I have them add cucumbers. Oh. And so all their dressings come in the side, but if I wanted to recreate this a different way, they'd be more than happy to do it. Okay. Um, but really cool company, super easy to eat healthy. They cater. I mean, I love them. I They're love great. the dressing on the side, too, because yeah, then it's your control. Well, it seems to gonna... be a reasonable amount. We were talking off air. Yeah. A lot of the fast food places that have salad, by the time you add everything in that they add, it's not healthy. Right. Anymore. And they're all gluten free. I'm, I happen to live a gluten free lifestyle, so it's super easy for me there. All the salad dressings are gluten free. Some of them are vegan. They have vegan options for our vegan friends. So, awesome. doing it right. What's down the road here? Then, what else would be on the options? Chipotle. So, Chipotle mm -hmm. is pretty locally you know, available too, meaning they have a couple restaurants here in the Milwaukee area. What would you do there? Sam's a big, heavy burrito that's going to put you in a food coma. Ah. Okay? Uh, yes, but so, it's a nice food coma. Uh, so, what would we get? Lovely. A chicken salad. Okay, so you know, there's no shell, there's no rice. It's all of um, the veggies. So there's as much salsa as you want to use. The fire roasted vegetables are on here. And then what I get is I avoid the extra cheese and I put um, a side of guacamole on it. So with the guacamole, you're getting more of a fiber punch. You're getting those healthy fats that fire up your brain. And again, after something like this, you're not going to feel that, ugh. After lunch, you want a little more fiber punch, get another 10 grams of fiber having the beans on it. You could also put the beans on it. What I would tell you to do cautiously is notice again, Rob, we talked about how much dressing. Right. This was the amount of dressing they gave you. And quite honestly, when you have the salsa and the guac on there, you don't really need a whole bunch more yeah. liquid. But kind of be careful with the dressings because this is where the sugar and sodium comes in. So using that very sparingly. So you're better off with the, the guacamole or something like that. Yep, the so you guacamole. Almost do like a naked taco, as they say. Yep. So just thinking about you know going to those uh, Mexican type restaurants and you don't necessarily need to get tacos and burritos. You could get a really delicious and this is a filling salad where you'll be good to go. Sure, cool. even uh, Taco Bell offers that cantina bowl thing, which cantina. is a close idea. Mm -hmm. Then what about something else that we have in Milwaukee area? What about a Panera? So Panera, same thing. When I'm going out to a restaurant, what I'm looking for is I want um, filling food. I don't want to be hungry in an hour. Yeah. So mm -hmm. I need a salad that has some protein on it. So this comes with chicken and a hard-boiled egg. Um, it's loaded with, again, some nice healthy greens instead of the um, baguette, the apple. You can get the apple, yeah. And always the choice is water. Water, 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 more water. So 
You're looking for fiber and protein to fill you up, so we're looking for that when we're kind of trying to pick our options. Notice all of these are not heavy with the starchy stuff. Right. Yeah. The starchy stuff makes your blood sugar go up, and then it crashes and you're hungry in an hour. Right. And crabby. And crabby. Tired. You don't want to this. Yeah. yeah. So, you know, I couldn't do a segment. I know people are at home saying, okay, Lisa, we get it, but we're not eating salads every day. What are we going to do if we're going to go for the burger? Totally get it. I too indulge in a burger. And where I would say is where I got this one from here was the restaurant's called Five Guy. So Five oh, Guys. Five Guys. Five they do guys, a lettuce thing? I didn't they know that. They do a lettuce wrap really? there. So what I do when I go for a burger, mm -hmm. I get it bunless, and then I load up on all the veggies I can get on it. So Five Guys is awesome because they will do that, unlimited toppings. So you can do, and there I have sautéed mushrooms, onions, green peppers, and jalapeno peppers. Mm -hmm. Comes in a lettuce wrap. And I got the quote unquote, they call it the little cheeseburger, which is not normal size, you right. know? Yeah, yeah. So I got the little cheeseburger and the little fry. And even the little fry, I mean, it's a lot of French fries. Amount of fries. And they have great French fries. So, you know, if you're going to go. They did that. Mm -hmm. So cool. go for the bunless and go for the smallest size of the burger and load up on the veggie toppings. Fewer buns, fewer buns. And if you're still hungry, <laughs> yeah, like right? if you're still good. hungry, fill up on the free peanuts. They, oh, they have those there too. Well, of okay, course, I you about know that. Rob would know all the inside freebies. Yeah, How did I miss that? Is this gonna turn my? You know what? Well, beets do naturally um, turn the... I just need to be aware. Yes. Yeah, how can we say that? Don't Our, panic in yeah, 24 in the, hours. In the toilet, there might be something a little red. That okay. is normal. Beets well, do do I'm, that. You know. Good point, Nicole. I mean, I need to... Thank you. Yes. Okay. Okay. We could have had some sense. viewers calling in saying, what's going on with the beets? But beets do this naturally. Do Poor Jason's okay. going to get a horrible wake-up call yeah. tomorrow morning. Jason! Yeah, but oh, right, wait, false alarm. Beats. Right. This is the beats. This the beats. is the beats. All right. Well, thank you very much. Will this we'll turn be back. Green? We've got no. Ooh. No, no beets. Try. Everyone will do it. You know, if you had a lot, a lot, a lot of greens, yes, it do could. Do it. Drink it all. But that, all right. no. We'll link to her from our side. We'll be back.